I know it doesn't work like that. Why didn't you ever say anything? Part of it was timing. It had only been a month. But then the best thing in the world happened to me. Oh, thanks. Oh, okay. Thanks. Summer rain is falling like it's never gonna stop here. It's been ages. Mondale and Ferraro. Mondale and Ferraro, path to equality. No, thanks. What are you, a Republican? Oh, I'm sorry. Did you catch it from your parents? I care it's hereditary. I guess I did. Watch while you sleep. Well, if you don't want a pamphlet, here. Have a pin on me. Sometimes I get the feeling that I've always known. I might wear it, but only because it's stylish. You know, if you're not a pamphlet reader, I could take you to coffee. Tell you all about why Mondo and Ferraro are gonna lose. I'm so sure they're gonna lose. Why bother? I don't know. It feels right. So coffee? Yeah. I guess I had fate on my mind when I got you this gift. Where on earth did you find this? I turned the house upside down. If it hadn't been for Walter Mondale and Geraldine Ferraro, then that would have been a set call. There wouldn't be a Ryan. And whoever this is going to be. <laughs> all because of that one day. My lucky day. My lucky day. Let's start today, tomorrow. OK, I admit it. I put way too much stock into that poem. But I'm not the girl that you thought I was. You're not. You, Summer, are better. See, back then you were just this fantasy or this little girl who, when I would see, you would either ignore me or make an obscene gesture and keep on walking. Yeah, I kind of remember that, sorry. Yeah, but now look at you. You fight for sea otters, you've befriended Taylor Townsend, you're an incredible mom to that bunny. I guess I have changed. You've evolved. And over the last 950 days we've been dating, and yes, I've counted, and yes, I counted the Zack era, because really, who are we kidding? I've watched you grow into this incredible woman. And that is who I love. Thanks, Colin. What's wrong? I met George. I'll kill him. This guy came by from George to recruit me. He heard about my work with the Sea Otters and invited me to travel across the country and talk to college kids about voting next November. But what about Brown? I'd have to defer a year. Live on a bus. Sounds like a great gig. I don't know that we could see each other. So, you have to choose between me and George. That's the thing. I don't know that I have to. I do believe that you are my destiny. I do, Seth. I just don't know that you're my only destiny. Here. Happy Valentine's Day. Mm-hmm. I pick couples through time. Oh. Where are we? I was hoping that someday we could go in the middle. What both surprises? I can't hold it any longer. Sure. His plane is sitting on the tarmac, gassed up and ready to take you anywhere in the world. Mom, you're gonna be spending Valentine's Day anywhere in the world that you wanna go. I mean, that's pretty amazing. Yeah. Yeah, it really is. Oh no. Mom.
work. Where the heck's your mom? I know I asked you to be my stepdad, but do you mind being my friend instead? So, Julie's had enough of the old bullet, hey? We can still play ping pong together. You know I'll let you win. You don't. Yes, I do. In your dreams. You ever see that movie, Casablanca? No. It goes like this. Peanut, I think this is the beginning of a beautiful friendship. Come on, lucky lady, lucky lady. Oh! I can't believe this didn't win. Shocking. Well, if it's any consolation, though, this soft serve is outstanding. Would anyone like seconds? Yeah, I would. Yeah, <laughs> me too. Sorry, things didn't work out with you and Julie. Hey. I'm sitting here sharing ice cream with my kid. It's been a long time since I've done that. Tell me that's her. Suddenly nervous. It'll be great. I push my way inside. My heart froze as I saw the pieces of your clothes. I'm having the strangest craving for a corn dog. There may be one left. I saw you try to hide the moment. How about that? Fourth quarter, Team Frank comes through in the clutch. Oh, yeah. True love on Valentine's Day. What more could you ask for? Hey, uh, so, you know, we reserved the limo for another two hours. What do you say we drive down the beach? Ah, uh, that sounds suspiciously like a Valentine's Day date to me. I don't know, that might make us break up. What if I said... I had newfound faith. I would say I agree. I have the fun face. I agree. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Onwards, Jeeves. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> to the beach.